1960s, Harding University in Searcy helped them prepare, part of a relationship that continues to this day. Channel 7's Ashley Butler has more. Harding University is just one of Arkansas's colleges that offer STEM programs with NASA, giving students the opportunity to participate in real lab research. So NASA has a program called NASA Space Grant that allows for uh, funding in universities around the nation to help support NASA research projects. Where students can obtain grants and funding from the Arkansas Space Grant Consortium to help support the research. So uh, as a biochemistry student, each one of us has to do a full senior seminar presentation over research that we've conducted our, while our time at, here at Harding. Working with NASA to assist with their water treatment program. I worked with, uh, through the help of the Arkansas Space Grant uh, Consortium, they've funded the research of uh, how we can work with the International Space Station to uh, disinfect their water. We try to determine a process to where we can disinfect and destroy all the biofilm, and we've been using photocatalysis for that. And another STEM program student was chosen to be a NASA Eclipse ambassador for the upcoming April 8th solar eclipse. I think that it is definitely a really special opportunity, one that I have been really blessed to be involved with. It has helped me not only grow as a person in my leadership abilities and just as a student in general, but also helped me reach out to the community more and become more involved with the people that I interact with on a daily basis allowing ambassadors to be advocates and sharing information about the eclipse. On your side in Searcy, I'm Ashley Butler. Well, Harding is sponsoring a NASA Day on campus April 5th. 1,500 area school children expected to attend and learn about eclipses and different NASA projects.